The very main way to help save turtles is by conserving them. There are plenty of conservation centers for turtles in Malaysia that are actively running and helping in this issue. For example, Turtle Conservation and Information Center Kuala Dungun in Terengganu and Cerating Turtle Sanctuary in Pahang. They started by setting up nests for the turtle eggs and weeks for them to hatch. Every night, rangers on duty check up on the nest to see whether the eggs are hatched yet or not. When the eggs are already hatched, baby turtles are released into the sea. Even though the percentage of the eggs to hatch safely is high, the percentage of surviving baby turtles are very very low. This is because they have to face many of the predators such as crabs and lizards before getting to the water. However, being in the water are still dangerous since birds are also hunting for them. Usaha pemuliharaan penyu di Sabah mula menampakkan hasil positif. Kajian selama dua tahun yang dilakukan Universiti Malaysia Sabah mendapati lebih 70% penyu yang ditemui di perairan Mabul dan Sipadan merupakan penyu muda. Kira-kira 700 ekor penyu hijau dan penyu sisik ditanda untuk tujuan pendidikan di kedua pulau yang menjadi lokasi bagi populasi spesies yang diancam keupusan itu.